Can you also talk about the significance of Java in the modern world where we talk about Kubernetes and cloud and all those shiny objects? So I, uh, before we talk about partner you know, and importance of channel, I would like to also emphasize the importance and role of Java in the modern world. Okay, so um, well, let's just talk about, first of all, Java in general, and then we'll talk about how that relates to Azure because we have many customers. In fact, um, we have about 36% of the Fortune 100 that use, use Azure. Um, many people may have not have heard of us, but, um, but just let's put it in the context. So because Java has been around for a long time, it's been used in a variety of different desktops, server infrastructure type of applications, and predominantly in applications that require a lot of um, compute transaction processing, um, for instance, trading floors, um, obviously financial services, anything to do with banking, um, supply chain manufacturing, um, telcos, obviously for things like interconnect billing. Java has been the mainstay of, of, of those type of applications. And, and the reason why is because it was built for high performance um, when it was first invented. And you look in, in time now, there's different languages around. There's things like you know Python, there's things like um, C++. They're really great for apps, things that sit on your iPhone, things that sit in more smaller controlled environments. And Python is used extensively maybe in security, things that um, are more embedded. Um, but there isn't really a good alternative still for Java. So Java has been really, a, it's still used predominantly by all the large organizations today globally across all industries. And, and really, the, the versioning and, and the, the um, performance that's improved over the years continues to be what people look for around Java. For example, you know, right from Java 6 and 7, which is probably 20 years old, through to where we are Java 23 and beyond. Um, there's different versions of Java. There's different applications being used. And, and the majority of what, what it's being used for is to power big, large um, business applications. So hopefully that gives you a bit of context. Um, it's also not the type of thing that's going away anytime soon, as I mentioned, because obviously there isn't a great alternative out there, um, having been a programmer myself. 